Welcome to another episode of Technology Bites. I am Naveen Balani. In this fixed episode, we will be talking about what is ethical AI and how you can build responsible and ethical AI applications. So let's get started. So what is ethical AI? Ethical AI, in simple words, is about ensuring your AI models are fair, ethical, and unbiased. So let's first understand. How does bias gets into the AI model? Let's assume you are building an AI model which provides salary suggestions for new hires. As part of building the model, you have taken gender as one of the features, and you are using the features along with other set of features to suggest salary. Now, this model is trying to discriminate salary based on gender. In the past, the bias has been going through various human judgments and various social and economical factors. But if you include this bias as part of the new model, then this model will start discriminating salary based on gender. The whole idea is to build a model which is not biased and suggests salary based on people experience and merits. Let me talk about another example. Let's take an example of an application providing restaurant recommendation and allowing a user to book a table. Now, while recommending new restaurants, the AI application is designed to look at the amount spent in previous transactions and rating of the restaurant, along with other set of features. And the AI system start recommending restaurants which are costlier. Now, even though there might be good restaurants in the vicinity. And maybe less costly, the restaurants may not show up as one of the top recommendations. Also, due to economics, as the amount spent by the user implies more revenue for the restaurant application, basically, the restaurant application is steering a class of user towards spending more money on high-end restaurants without the user knowing about it. This poses an interesting question. Does this classify as a bias, or is just a smart revenue generating scheme? Ethical AI basically touches upon all these important topics, and it's a great topic for research and debate. And you would see a lot of developments and governance that need to happen in this space of building ethical application. As the standards are still evolving, but how can you ensure? That you build models and application in an ethical way and validate it. I am sharing one of the perspectives, but there can be many such perspectives on how can you build ethical AI application. The first thing is you should design the AI model without any bias. Ensure you don't include the features that make your model bias. For instance, don't include gender. While predicting the salary packages, take enough time to validate the data sources and the features being used to build the model. The second step is to explain the model output. Now, designing applications with explainability in mind should be a key design principle. If the user receives an output from an AI algorithm providing why an output was presented. And how relevant it is should be built into the algorithm. This basically empowers users to understand why a particular information is being presented to him, and turn off any preferences associated with the AI algorithm for future recommendations. The last step is accountability and auditability. For instance, take an example of server auditing. Where you have tools that log every request and response, track changes in the environment, monitor the access controls and risk, and provide end-to-end -end transparency. The same level of auditing is required when AI delivers an output. For instance, what was the output? What version of model was used? What features were evaluated? What data was used for evaluation? What was the confidence score? 
what was the threshold what output was delivered and finally what was the feedback all this process would help you to understand the end to end life cycle of how an ai output is being delivered and what feedback is received by the system now ultimately humans needs to look at the output and take corrective action so providing enough choices to the end user and let the user take the required action should be a key design principle so with this design principles in mind let's revisit our astron application and look at how we can build an ethical ai application and make the output explainable to the user now the restaurant application can have minimum four levels of recommendation along with an evidence on why a particular recommendation is being provided the first recommendation includes recommending restaurants based on earlier restaurant spends ratings history and the preference of the user the second recommendation would recommend similar restaurants which are highly rated and look at cost aspects also along with ratings history and the preference of the user the third recommendation can be recommending new restaurants based on user history and the preference of the user without any cost factors the fourth recommendation can be a recommendation generated by the system without applying any user preference the fourth recommendation does not use any ai and basically provides preferences to find restaurants using its own search criteria with this the revised restaurant application now provides various recommendation and enough evidences to back up the recommendation and ultimately the choice is left to the user to pick up the restaurant and book a table the example that i provided was a very simple application but imagine when ai is deployed across industries and in government agencies then developing and monitoring the ai system for ethical principles would be extremely critical both the creators of the model as well as validators which can be third party agencies validating the model would be critical to ensure ai models are fair ethical and unbiased to conclude this video i would say as we are creators and validator of the ai system the onus lies on us to ensure technology is used for good with this thought i like to wrap up the video hope you found the information useful and please do subscribe to the channel to receive regular updates till then have a great week and thank you for watching